See my school back. Would that be the rhinestone one, Elvis? Is that a tide mark you're hiding? No. Mm -hmm. So, um, why have you got your collar turned up? Maybe he's got a bolt in his neck or a big scar. Oh, did someone try and cut your head off, love? Well, just give us my school bag, will you? Hey, you see you. <gasps> I knew it! Look at that! Uh, Was well, she hungry? Give her a bag of chips next time, son. Mind your own business, all of you. Go on. Oh, <laughs> what you like? Before you start, don't say anything to the lad. That Candice has been out with Vic and God knows who else. The girl's experienced. Hey, that's not what I heard. The best mate's got a baby. Yeah, but she's not. Birds of a feather. <laughs> you thought it was funny this morning? It's still funny, but I want it to stay that way. They're just a couple of kids. They'll, they'll hold hands, have a bit of a kiss and a cuddle. Well, as long as you make sure that's all they do do. Me? If I say anything, he'll be embarrassed. So don't say anything. He needs to be warned about women's wiles. Some girls can't wait to get their clutches on a lad. She just wants a bit of fun. Exactly. You've seen the teeth marks. Just wait till she digs her claws in. Can't he make his own mistakes? She's already drawn blood. What more do you want? Just have a word for me. Oh, Eileen, no. Yes. So, what did your mum say? She was on it like a radar. Yeah, well, no wonder we your collar stuck up like that. I'm keeping my net warm for you. I'm not a vampire, you know. What are you up to? Nothing. Just waiting for a bus, are you? Oh, leave him alone. Do you want something, Mum? I do, as a matter of fact. If you're walking out with Candice, I think it's about time she came for a tea. Tea? That's right. Do right with you, love. Friday night, OK? Yeah, OK. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Next time you see her, keep your mouth shut, all right? And let her have her evil way with my little baby. <sighs> Lay off. Fine, knowing I'm not wanted. <clears throat> what? Uh, oh, job, um... You know your mum means well. Yeah, right. No, she does. And she's... Well, she's worried you might, um What? Get in too deep. Meaning? Well, you know. Sex. Yeah. Have you guys been talking about this? Well, your mother has. I don't believe it. It's none of your business. Oh, hey, I know. So shut it. I can't. I promise your mother. Hey, look, Todd, it's not easy for me either, you know. I haven't got a lot of my own. Save your breath. I'm not up for adoption. Your mother's worried you're getting too serious, too young, with the last whose mate has got a baby. I said shut it. If I want advice, I've got a father of my own. Yeah, but he's not here, is he? Don't you say one word about my father. Fair enough. So how am I going to get your mother off my back? Say nothing. I won't say anything either. After five minutes, we call her in and tell her we bonded. All right? All right. <laughs> 